Look at these three poor, brave young men, slain by their own fathers, almost heroes. But let's begin this story from the beginning. Dude, this stinks. We walked all the way here. Dude, we should have had your mom drive us here. To the forest and beyond. Who said that? Oh, it must be this guy. <laughs> Get out of here. <laughs> Would it take him to get here? I'm guesstimating five minutes because it took me five minutes to get here. Man, but I am glad that you reminded me to get a shirt, a sweatshirt, and pants because it's kind of cold out. Should have brought a jacket. Hey, Austin, why is that bunny over there eating the grass and that wolf eating the bunny? Well, you see, the grass gets the energy from the sun, which makes it grow. Which the bunny eats the grass, which the wolf eats the bunny. When the wolf dies, decomposers, like bacteria, decompose the wolf and make fertile soil for the grass. And what's that called again? It's called a food chain. And isn't a bunch of food chains put together a food web? Why, yes it is, Ben. Why, yes it is. Look, a bear! Where? Ah! Run away! Bears have adapted to survive in this! Place in many ways. Oh, <laughs> oh poor Austin. Oh. Oh. <laughs> they have sharp claws to rip you apart, and they have a natural sense of killing to eat. Survival, survival of the fittest. Ah. survival of the fittest. <laughs> They're also very delicious, and they have a layer of fat. To keep them warm from the cold. I wonder if they're okay. Oh, they're okay. Pansy, that was only a rabbit. Who would do this? I don't know. It's it's terrible the way they did this. Hey, what's that guy doing? I don't know. What the heck? Get him! Humans need to stop looting the forest. Or else. What kind of food is this? It's food that you're gonna eat if you're hungry. Oh my god, baby bear! Get it! Get it! Uh, I'll get it with my trusty toothbrush! Get him! Uh, oh yeah. Yes. Got him. All right, guys. You see, bears are a very delicious and exotic dish in the forest. They're very succulent, and they have a layer of fat, which is good if you're hiking and trying to survive in the woods, because fat is good, and it gives you carbohydrates, and it keeps you warmer. But killing this little baby bear is not very good, not very smart, because there's probably a mama bear looking around, trying to find her baby bear. <sighs> oh my god, it's the mama bear! Run! Ah! Run, leave the stuff! Leave the stuff! Run, run, run. Ah! Ah! Survival of the fittest! Ah! Ah! Oh, it's distracted by trying to save the baby bear! Run! Ah! Ah! Leave the stuff! Run, run! Leave the stuff! Survival of the fittest! Okay. This Thanks. Fishing poles, eighty dollars. Hunting rifles and necessary accessories, including the cool keychain, eight hundred and twenty-five dollars. Three tents, 
$360. Getting mugged by a bear and having to spend the whole week trying to keep each other warm? Priceless. For everything else, there's MasterCard. Look at this plant. Isn't it beautiful? It is a random plant that we just randomly found uh, walking along this path into the woods. It is adapted by growing tall and out of reach of the smaller animals. <laughs> this is a very fluffy and amusing plant. See, it's, it's fluffy, fluffy. Um, oh my god, <laughs> I think I broke it. Okay, um, it has adapted by growing fluffy and animals that don't like fluffiness, they, they just won't touch it. Oh, and look, here's some poison ivy. What did I learn about poison 